just the satisfaction of everyone else knowing that like like you're talented, you're working, and we support it. Mm -hmm. Like that's my prize. I think it's the first episode back, probably. We have an absolute legend. I mean, look who it is. It's it's incredible. Yes, it's sir. Thank you for What's coming, up, bro. Thank for you real. for having me, brother. Yes. Um, okay, right off the bat, I saw the video of your Rolling Loud performance, uh -huh. and I know that that was your... That's like your hometown, right? Yeah, yeah, Where I'm from was. Inglewood. Yeah. yeah, you're from Inglewood. What is that moment like? Like, when you're on stage, like... Did you know, first of all, how big of a turnout it was going to be? And then when you step out there, are you, like, in your head? you got to perform, too. Right. Are you, like, tri like what does that feel like? Um, well, to be honest, uh, the stage that, that Rolling – shout out to Rolling Loud. But the stage that I was assigned, yeah. looking at it days previous, I was kind of, like, looking at all the other artists that might have been performing at that stage. And I was kind of, like – I feel like they don't know my worth. You right, know what I mean? Right. Not not like they had me on a, like a like a mediocre stage. The stage mm -hmm. was all the artists that hit that stage, super talented. Right. But I felt like, bro, like I'm in LA. Like, right? It's do my you guys city. not know type yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. whatever. Right. I went and then um that the the turnout I had um on stage and stuff like that. All the people that came through to watch me perform that it, it it's I had no idea it was gonna turn out like that. I kind of had a I'm lying. I kind of had like a small feeling, but I didn't really know that it would really be. You like never that. know for sure no. what it's going to be. Yeah, I've never done a, a D Savage Rolling Loud LA. Right. I've done a Miami one, but right. So so to see that turnout, it was kind of like. It was kind of like um like wow man my my city's with me they they see this going on now we need the these these vendors and these festival right. people to see this and know like okay. Not only am I back, but I'm here to stay, and yeah. I'm, I'm 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 coming full throttle with it. So. It's real deal. Yeah. And the song that you come out with is about exactly that. Literally. It's Literally. like so many like moments culminating into one. Yeah. How the f do you focus on? Okay, I gotta perform though. Yeah. Um. Bro, if I'm, I can't I can't even lie to you, Nirvana. Like, bro, I have so much time. I spent. When all right, when 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 the internet wasn't really too fond of D Savage a couple years ago, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I had no nothing but time right. to sit down and plan out. Right. Okay. All right. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna work this way to right. the point where I'm gonna let my work speak for itself. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna speak on the internet like how I used to uh -huh. and stuff like that. I'm gonna let my work show for itself. And ever since I've been doing that, I've kind of I mean you're always gonna have the haters. Don't get me wrong, but right. ever since I've been doing that, I've had more people that. If they weren't a fan at a given time, now they they appreciate the work and they see the they see the growth and stuff like that. So it just gives me um it gives me something to also look forward to. Yeah, like because okay. this is you just really okay. Like you were planning all this behind the scenes, right. like you said, yeah. but this is just the start of like your plan actually yeah. rolling out. Yeah, that's got to feel good. It feels great, and it yeah. feels great that it's going to plan, mm -hmm. if not better, because I didn't expect it to kind of be like this fast. Mm -hmm. Um. But I mean, really, it's, like, it's you're surprised by it. Yeah, yeah, nice. yeah, bro. Yeah. How many artists do you know? I know that can like, like revamp the whole shit. fully though. Yeah, like, bro. When everybody hate and and the thing is, I feel like I don't know, man. I, I the, the time I had to myself to spend working on myself, I really tried my hardest to fix all the little things that need to be fixed. I'm not perfect. Yeah, but yeah. I, I just no tried my hardest to just like now. I'm about to be 25 years old this year, bro. Like, I can't, I'm not. Just a youngster. Just a young person. Yeah, but I'm getting old, though, man. So I can't keep, I can't keep doing the same little high right, school. Right, right. Spiels and stuff like that. Man, I, Do you feel like it? you needed that experience to, yeah. like, trial and error, fi figure out what wasn't working for you? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. For sure, for sure. Because, you know what I mean? Nobody around me at that time was in the industry to, like, tell me, like, hey, mm -hmm. bro. Actually, you know what? Tyler told me, bro. Mm -hmm. But way back then, Tyler the Creator, he used to he used to I remember when I first started like rapping and shit and I'm getting in the streets, I remember he saw and was like like, "Bro, what are you doing? Type you got too much going on over here to try to fuck that shit up." You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So, mm -hmm. but at that given time, I was like, "Bro, what are you talking about?" Like like you felt like head. you could do both or what was it that made you want to do it? I felt like I could do both. Right. Like, what are you talking about? Like right. like and then when you feel like you could do both and then like you're starting to do the rap, you're going to bring some of those practices you did in the streets with you. Mm -hmm. 
which a lot of these people don't want to see or they're not here for that. Right. And they really right. don't care about that type yeah, of thing. Yeah, yeah. So you just gotta kind of got to learn to like, oh, it's a business. And what does that mean? It means X, Y, and Z. And now let's move And they're, they're your customers. Like, they're obviously right. fans that you connect with personally. Right. It's more personal than just right. like a business. But mm-hmm. they are your customers. Right. And what I feel like, like, as a D Savage fan is that they were ready. They were ready, waiting patiently. Mm-hmm. Because there's obviously going to be all the other noise. And then you exactly gave them, delivered what they were, like, waiting for. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. that's all there is to it. Yeah. Yeah. So now, what do you think I should do? Should I just keep staying consistent with the music? That's you should absolutely keep staying consistent with the music. Because, like, other people, I would almost be like, okay, do stay consistent with the music, but I feel like other people really, like, don't know how to fully curate their I feel like when you put something out, you know it's going to be, like, a good D Savage right. song. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And is that, what, what does that, like, come from? Is that, like... Making enough songs, then like you're just so specific about it. I feel like there's a lot of thought there. Yeah, there's a lot of thought there now because, like I said a couple of years ago, when I had more than enough time to kind of like chill back and work on the revamp of right. these habits, like I sat back and I also looked at it from a fan's perspective or a supporter's perspective. Like, yes. what is the like what is the the most favorite songs by the Mass? Like, okay, they like this, 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 and this. Right. What's my favorite song? My favorite song that I made is probably this, this, and this. Okay, well, yeah, even though this is my favorite and this is what the people want to hear, mm-hmm. I need to make sure that I can appeal to the mass just as much as I can appeal to the music I want to hear myself make. Yes. You Because they do meet in the middle. That that sure. middle ground yeah. is where the, the hits are made, the right. beautiful music is made. Right. Yeah. And, and, and then you have some artists out there like, I feel like Lil Uzi Verts and like all these other dope artists out there right now that's like Lil Uzi, like that song that I just want to rock. Mm-hmm, Bro, mm-hmm. that's just so fucking hard. And it's like, did he even do a verse on that song? I don't think so. I think no. it's just the hook. It's two hooks back but, to back. But I'm saying that to say, like, yeah. like, what a mood, what a choice. Come on, bro. That's- crazy when you're listening to a song like that like it took me probably like the third or fourth listen it'd be like there's no verse right but i remember like the first time i'm listening to it i'm kind of like oh, okay this is giving me like intro interlude time basically what i'm saying is just like how i'm pretty sure uzi want to make music that he likes to listen to but he also has a fan base out there that knows that they probably want to listen to all types of different versions of yourself right I feel like he does a very good job at yes. at, at, at mixing and, and just just making sure all the content is like appealing to a lot of different people, and that's where I'm. That's I, 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 when people think of D Savage, I want my name to be like on that creative span of like yes, artists like a that. real artist, yeah, not yeah, just yeah. like there's a gimmick, there's like the image, because all that is right. already there. Those ingredients have always already been there, exactly. Yeah, and the fact that you took time away to like think about it. Now you like you thought about it logically. You laid yeah. it out for yourself. Yeah, that's like an sure. amazing thing. For sure. Yeah. For sure. For sure. And like I gotta, I gotta shout out the um, I gotta shout out the Trippy Reds, and I gotta shout out the Lil Yachty's and stuff like mm-hmm. that because those are the only names that um, and I don't even like like talking about rappers' names yeah. and like that yeah. no more. But I, I gotta be honest, those two right there, like and and within a, cause you know I got I I got mental problems and all types of. Sh- Mm-hmm. When my friends know or tap in with me to make sure I'm okay like that, that's the type of shit that means the most to yeah, me because these are dudes that I know are on the top of the world. You know yeah. what I mean? And they'll, yeah. they'll still make sure to stop and, hey, bro, you good? Or, hey, okay. And now, like, I'm getting, I could, now when I talk to these artists, it's, they, they talk to me like, bro, proud of you. Like, yes. you got to keep going type, like, don't lose sight of focus and shit like that. And I won't. But yeah. it's little stuff like that, you know, because those dudes mean the most to me. So it's right. little like that. That's like, oh, okay, yeah, I get it. So this is probably what y'all went through too. Not maybe this, not the same scenario, but we all kind of had to go through the same to get yes. higher and higher. The the people that are on top of the world, however you want to define it, it's the same set of problems and issues right. and and thinking thought right. process. Just. There's a lot at stake. Exactly. There's more. And then as you go up through that, like the way that you're thinking is I really think like the right way to for go. Sure, about it. For yeah. sure. For sure, for sure. And then like I don't I don't I don't want to sound ignorant with this statement, but it's like, okay, like, 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 okay. Just like how you said, right? Like mm-hmm. we can we can be dealt the same cards, but it's up to us how we handle the situation. Yes. Meaning we can go to the hood right now, right? Find like ten hood dudes, right? Right. And say, look. I got a I got a million dollars each for y'all, right now, right? Mm-hmm. We can go to 
Beverly Hills, Hollywood Hills, the play find ten people over there. Mm-hmm. Got a million dollars for y'all, right? Mm-hmm. And for, for, for whatever, I got a million, but it, but it's a job, right? Right. And then um, so 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 now with every single jo- okay, you're 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 a camera content creator, right? I'm pretty sure there's you inspired a million people to start doing shit like that. So now, like like. They can be dealt the same cards that you've been dealt with. Mm-hmm. It could be the same fire set, but it's up to the person. You get what I'm saying? Yes, like it's yes. Up to, it's up how you to, decipher it. It's almost like right. like to connect it to what you're saying, like what I do. It's like you can be given, this, this is just a metaphor, but right. you can be dumped all this footage, right? Right. And then one person can make the world's greatest video out of that same footage mm-hmm. and then one can make it one way another way not so good amazing right. it's just about like how you organize it in your head right. and i feel like i really like can feel that you like took your time to do that and i know that your fans think that too yeah I, I, yeah and and i'm pro i wouldn't be nowhere if it wasn't for my fans bro. yeah nowhere what does that feel like to have to like know that they're out there and exist and then you see them like we said like i have rolling loud like on bro on the way here some fans were chasing me bro i swear to god bro i swear to god i had to fucking do like 80 on the streets bro setting a 90 just now on the streets bro but i love it bro. yes yeah i love bro right i love this bro i love it i love it because bro i'm telling you a couple years ago bro these nobody liked me bro and which was all understood. I've said some very nasty things in my life that I don't regret. I think though. there were some but of us, but you really, you really felt that way. Yes, bro. Yeah, yeah, bro. And and you know what I mean. And right, okay, you are right. Like like it definitely was some of us, maybe not all, but it's like the some, the some people that are affected will let you know. Like I hate that kid, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then the people that do. F- with you, they're not gonna let you know. Like, I love you though, bro. Right, 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 right. So they're not as vocal I'm, about it. Right. Yeah. So all yeah. I see is just like hate, 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 hate. Yeah. And I'm seeing a lot of hate from people I've never met. Yeah. But and that still got like pull in the rap game. So it was kind of like, bro, what the, like, the f- going on? Right. If you if we haven't met face to face, like, what's the basis? Yeah. Bloggers talking about me and shit, but. But I think I do think. By the way, like try and try and like like go like right into the mic. But I think. There's a quote like from somewhere. I, I've said this before at some point, but like mm-hmm. the biggest stars are fifty fifty. Like there right. has to be that dichotomy of love and hate because yeah. it just means that you're doing something interesting. Yeah, yeah and it's right. it's part of the territory. Like you are becoming a huge artist, and it's gonna it's gonna come at a, at a cost. Yeah. But if that cost is only like a few people over there, like saying, yeah, yeah, but yeah. then you have all these people that love you. It's like yeah, yeah. And, yeah. I, mean, and I just had that's so crazy that you're saying that because I just had to learn to love that. Because it's like the small people that's over here that don't matter that might be saying, like to me those meant, like, like those people meant so much to me, mm-hmm. and it might not be like I don't have to like literally like know the these people that mm-hmm. that might be talking bad about me, but it's like I cared so much. Yes. About. It's hard not to. Don't get. It's easier said than done. What I'm yeah, saying. But, yeah. But I mean, but now the older I get, the more I understand the prize. So mm-hmm. it's easy for me to to move off what you just said nowadays. Mm-hmm. In a sense of like, man, who cares, man? Just 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 keep going with the people that love you and support right, you. Right. 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 I can do that now with no problem. But it took like if I didn't just like how you said if I didn't go through all that other type of stuff, I probably wouldn't have the the, the mind to even be like like it's okay type sh- now. Yeah. Like like. Man, I'm telling you, Nirvana. A couple years ago, bro, I was on some sh- like, I really said f- rap, bro. Like, yeah. Really said f- rap. I kept going to jail, and I kept having to be like, bro, like I'm not about to keep doing this. Sh-. Like I don't want to go everywhere, and everyone was like, man, we remember you, like you right, know, right. The no. I know God, like bro, yes. what the f-? right? I don't even like what the. F-? So I yeah. just had to get on my shit, bro. Right. And that prize you're talking about was that something? Do you mean just like the? The overall, like the rewards that come with like doing what you do. Yeah, when I say prize, I don't mean like a literal, pr- like 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 trophy or like money or something like that. I mean like just the satisfaction of everyone else knowing that like like you're talented, you're working, and we support it. Mm-hmm. Like that's my prize. Like mm-hmm. everybody just being like, okay, cool. Like I, we're we're gonna give you, we're gonna give this guy a fair shot. We just let's just listen to the music, and then cool type like all that extra sh- that's that's considered my prize to me it's, it's like really a clean slate it's interesting because you it, it was just stripping things back it was just yeah. taking things away and like not doing as much which yeah. it's hard because like you can be like geared towards certain things but it's really like less work in the end yeah it really yeah. is it's really less work in the end but yeah. it's so crazy because it's so much work to make sure there's less work oh oh wow you know what I'm trying yeah to say? yeah mentally 
because you like these cameras only see that it's less work. Right. But they don't know in my mind. Right. Me telling myself mid sentence, shut the f up, stop right. talking about that. Right. Right. Stop right. Like, Mon monitoring in real time. Yeah. 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 How does that? How does that work for you mentally? And by the way, like I love how fucking. Oh, I know your fans are gonna love how open you are about like the way that yeah. you feel, bro. I was. You always we were say talking that, about really? that. Yeah. 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 I, I feel like I gotta be, bro, because yeah. like brothers. You know what I really hate, bro? I hate it What's when that? like, when like there's celebrities or whatever, and then like you see the way they. They talk to their fans or react with their fans, and they act like they're so, f like they're not human. Yes. Like like they're sh like they're some thing. elevated species. Right. Or like something. Yeah. like they wouldn't put on their pants one leg at a time, and like mm -hmm. that's the type of sh that makes me like that really makes my blood boil. Mm -hmm. Like seeing people get like that, especially with their supporters, I really don't like that. Yeah, when people are like mean to their fans or yeah, something, it's so I crazy. really don't li like. I yeah. really. Like and that. if you look at it, the biggest artists who are the most like beloved by their fans, take Juice and X, yeah. beloved, yeah. worshipped. Yeah. They were completely open about the way they felt. For sure, they were open about their mental health struggles, which every yeah. human, I don't give a who you are, has at some way, right. shape, or form. Right. And they connected in that way. They were for transparent. Sure. For sure. Yeah. For sure. For sure. And it's like when when you do stuff like that, the fans will never forget you, and they'll never forget what you did for them with the music. Mm hmm. You know what I mean? Because it helps them grow. I, you don't know how many messages I get a day like, bro, you don't know how much your music makes me say, fuck anybody that doesn't like me and I'm going to just keep doing me. And I'm, I'll am i respond to every last one of them like, you're right. Type, like, that really does go a long way. Long live X, long live Jared, Juice World. Um, I just have to get that out there. Yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah, but of course. Yeah, bro. Yeah, that's real, bro. For real. Music-wise, like, what is it that makes a D... Because this is from where I'm uh -huh. standing. A D Savage song sounds well thought out everything in place nothing out of pocket yeah. no off auto tune or like a line that has one too many syllables yeah what is that that makes it feel like such like a complete package i try to make nursery rhymes for the hood mm. like to quote that yeah yeah, yeah like yeah. um because you know some people some people would, would 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 call my beginning sound like soundcloud you know what i mean that vibe that air range mm. which is cool but it's like i had to take some time to be like I'm gonna switch it up, but what do what what, what do I want to switch it to? Like, so I went back, looked at the certain songs that are already that were doing really good back at that time. Like Opera, I got a song called Opera, mm -hmm. and if you like go back and listen to that song, that's like a nursery rhyme. Also, like I just like it's such a concise melody. There's opera. like it's just like there's not one word too many anyway. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> Fuck classic, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> Uh, easy yeah easy like yeah. i just I, I want i like making songs that's a no-brainer bro like bro um, when i ride around and i hear i came from nothing little, little, um, so, and that's easy i mean how are you try and not feel that in your yeah, soul come on, come on. Man. were you out of your mind we yeah. could do this all day bro yeah. we yeah. could do this all day but like i really had to just like how i sit, had to sit back and think about how i'm gonna reinvent myself and stuff like that mm -hmm. i also had to think like bro what do these fans really like about my music they mm -hmm. like the fact that i can like do different sounds and genres and different kind of beats and shit like that. So cool. Like, I'm going to make sure they get nothing but that type of bro. Mm -hmm. And I'm just focusing on making the best version of that. Yes. Do you feel when you're in this process of like either like thinking about what you want to do in the future or making an album like you just put out? When like when I'm when I have a video I'm working on that I know is going to take like a few weeks, uh -huh. I get really I just want to like get to that drop date. Right. You ever feel that? Like it's yeah. like so hard. I like you know you have to put the time into it, but like that drop date is so close. It's yeah, so yeah, far. Definitely. Yeah. And um and um like it's when I but when I every time I get like that, I'll be like, bro, you need to go back to work. Like mm -hmm. I'm, you're getting too excited about one thing right now. Type shit. like mm -hmm. like like it, it's hard to explain to people that don't make music and stuff like that because they don't like have these problems, but it's kinda like like when I made my first album, and you, not even me, just like when an artist probably makes their first album and they release it, they probably want to like live off that hype of the album right. for like a year right, right. or two. Mm -hmm. And I, I was guilty of that type of shit. I like going two years, three years without dropping another song or album and stuff like that. But mm -hmm. now in this day and age, that's not the vibe anymore, bro. No. Like, that's not the wave, bro. You, yeah. I'm, not, I, I, I'm not saying I drop music every day. But you got to be consistent, like, yeah. like, like. There's at, a level, right? Not look too at Nirvana. Much. You guys, Nirvana drops videos all the time, and I'm pretty sure that's like, it's not too much. 
Not too much. I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But Nirvan, he's very consistent with the stuff. And that Appreciate that's that. what makes a lot of people have to step back and look like, oh, yeah. I got to step my shit up. This yeah. is a real brand. This is a real thing. You know what I mean? That that so I'm I would just very stern on like everything around me just building it up the right way. It's like, like a that. business needs needs new products. You got to put yeah. out your beer company, you got to put out right. the light version and right. and keep it consistent. Right. And then yeah. just like how you how you said you're making a you drop a beer or something, you want your customers to not, to not be like, "Why the fuck did Nirvana just drop a beer?" Right, right, right. Should be right. like, what? Nirvana just dropped that. Beer. Yes, yes. Which what? is a I line. Need a case. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? They they call the order in. Right, just doing it the right way. Yeah. Last night I was going through. I I want to know if you ever do this because I was just curious. Like last night I was going through like my old stuff mm-hmm. and like feeling really like almost like emotional, like like just like how long it's been and like, um, like the journey of it all. And then it made me. I just worked all night last night to like eight a.m. Yeah. type. Shit. Do you ever, like, get in that, like, nostalgic mode? Like, what is, like, your mindset, like, around music? Or is it, like, strategically, I know this is going to sound good? I got to be brutally honest with you, bro. Yeah. Now, I I try to get myself in a studio, like, pretty often, type, maybe, like, out of seven days out the week, maybe, like, three to four, type. Mm Mm-hmm. But to, like, get the, um... Creative juices going. Right. Yeah. Like... When I start thinking about the past, I get so mad, Nirvan. Mm. Bro, it did me so foul, bro. Yeah. Like, tried to blackball me, tried to cancel my whole, before I even got started. Yeah. Like, foul, foul, foul. Like, yeah. They did, huh? Foul, bro. Yeah. 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 Niggas just did me foul, bro. Yeah. So foul to the point where it was just like, you know what? I don't ever, I don't ever want to, um like, see anybody have to go through that any like artists yeah. and stuff like that have to go th- and i'm and then I, I know there's artists i probably been through way worse than me and stuff like that but the little the little situations and stuff that i've already been through man if i can i'm gonna save anybody that you see going through that right. or about to go through that. right because i That's kn- true. i know for a fact everybody else isn't gonna have the same mental as me yeah to be able to be like no i'm gonna just reinvent this shit. just come back like to the where everybody going with this shit. like right, right. no people aren't going to be able to do shit like that it so. takes so much mental like stamina people don't understand how much uh, you have to be able to like put up with and like yes. the stamina it takes yes bro yeah. yes it takes a lot bro yeah it really does and how did you like what would you like tell an artist that like you see in the like a potentially same situation and then what was it like with everything that was going on that like allowed you to you just it, yeah. it's good enough music like the the music is so good that it's yeah, gonna carry but it's it. like in yeah. order to make that music yeah oh like, yeah your brain got to be in a whole area that's like 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 how are you going to make a happy fun song when you really want to say f- everybody and like mm-hmm. go do some shit that's going to put you right back in jail like, right right so I just had to like really sit back, talk to my mom. You know what I mean? Talk to my friend T right there. Mm-hmm. He, he's not on the camera, but he's right there. Turn my friend time. T, I talk, I got I got the right set of people around me to be like to show me what matters and what doesn't matter. Because my mind plays a lot of tricks on me sometimes. Mm-hmm. Like I know how I am. So when I hear somebody say something else, oh okay. I know how I all right. I know how I am. Mm-hmm. So if I hear somebody threaten me, like I won't take it lightly. And there's right. nobody threatening me or right, any right. any type of stuff like that. But it can but, come across that way. Right. Yeah. And I don't want my reaction to be like not wanted or like mm-hmm. not even needed. Like, bro, what are you doing? Like, chill. Like, right, what is it right. even meaning like that? Or just put you shit? in trouble or yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So now I'm now I just try to think about sh- like even even when people do have little funny slick shit to say, now I just yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Let it be like DJ Academics and stuff like that. Always have, always talking. Like he hasn't been saying too much about me lately. But even the last time he was, my rebuttals to all of that still is, it's all love. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah. I would just keep working, brother. Yeah, I don't know. That shows through so much more. Yeah. And I really think, like, as far as like artists in the future, like I feel like it's such a tough time for artists because the okay it used to be like the curve was like this Mm -hmm. it was like longer Mm -hmm. and now it's like such a spike Mm -hmm. and then the 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 potential for like just falling straight down is so much right but i i genuinely don't believe that like that is 
in the cards for D Savage. You know yeah, what I mean? No. And I don't think it was because you were established at such a time that yeah. made you like such a legend, and then like you've carried through for like this many years yeah. later with amazing music. Yeah. I don't think that's like a thing that you even need to worry about. Yeah, and now it's like, bro, I need to go as hard as I've ever went to yeah. to really just establish my name because now it's like, yeah, people know about D Savage and stuff like that, and yeah, 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 but like I needed to like. I, Granted, I don't want to do this, but like XX Double XL, like how mm-hmm. they have the the freshmen and all that stuff. Like, mm-hmm. what the D Savage thought about, or like, yeah, when it's all these other crazies, crazy. Like, I just did the first. I just did my first Rolling Loud Inglewood. Type, like, mm-hmm. wh- how? Right. You right, know what I mean. So right. that's that's what I'm that's what I'm focusing on right now is like making sure industry wise, I'm meeting all requirements. All those bridges are yeah. built. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I think that's just going to be a, st- a snowball effect until it's like until you have to be the one that's saying like, man, I don't have time for this. Okay, yeah, yeah I can do that. You know yeah, what yeah, I mean? Yeah. yeah. And, and 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 I'm so calculated that it's like, I've already thought uh, my brain's already been there. Yeah. So it's like, yeah. and I'm always make sure when I get there that I'm gonna still be nice and I'm gonna still be, have respect for people and I'm gonna still, you get what I'm saying? Like, yes. So and that still, goes a long way. I really think be open about about the mental. They they just will gravitate toward it and they will identify with it yeah. i keep saying this over and over but i just like no, i don't know no, like the way you speak about it is like so much more real than like 99.999 because i'm really going through this type of sh- not just yeah. saying this because sh- it sounds cool like bro yeah. when it's when it's when it's all said and done and i go home like man that type of thoughts and shit that i'll be thinking of i wouldn't even want nobody to ever think bro right ever right ever 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 and i don't take no medicine so i have to practice what i'm preaching mm-hmm. to have a good mind so do you have any like methods like like I do like I'll do a meditation once in yeah. a while go on a walk like yeah. what what do you do Uh um and lately I've been I've been doing really good but like it, when when nice. I when my body starts to fuck up and stuff and I can tell in my mind and stuff mm-hmm. bro when I wake up I need 45 minutes to myself Nice when, when I wake up Yeah just I, set that boundary I might be laying in bed I might have my eyes closed thinking about what am I what I'm about to do and Mm-hmm. I need that time though. For like, sure. I need that thirty minutes or forty five minutes to just okay. Yes. And then like like I always kinda have to remind myself like like bro, I'm only twenty four years old, but it's like I feel like I'm forty. Mm. In a sense of um you know like you know like 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 your parents, like like if they were to see you at school and they see like some kid getting bullied at school, your parents would be like, Okay, like you kids shouldn't be doing that. Like, you guys should love each other. Right, right. I understand that That's now. how you feel. Yeah, yeah. I understand it now. Yeah. I understand it. I, I fully understand where that comes from. It's perspective. I get it's it. It's like when people don't, like a young person that's like like our age, like, like 20, 24, 25, and there's just no type of, um, what do you call it? Like, like animosity or like right. anything that's gone wrong yep. in their life. Mm-hmm. Like they have no experience with that. A lot of times, like, they're just so, like, blind to life. how they, like, tr- life and, like, how they treat others because, yeah. like, they haven't gone through anything. Right. Like, I think you need, like, a couple, like, a couple, like, bruises on your back to really, you know what I mean? 100%. Yeah. 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 Like, empathy for others. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. 100%. 100%. And it's like, there's a lot of people that would never even understand what you're saying. Yeah. That's true. And They and, will one day. And those are the type of people that might have to say something about me. Right. So I had to realize, like, you guys don't matter. Yeah. And you just, it, it's just not, not for you, not for you to understand. Right. And hopefully they will one day. Yeah. And then when they do understand one day, if that happens, I'll be there still with my hand extended, ready to love you, brother, you shake go. your hand there and you stuff go. like that. But yes. Ascended. Right. That's the way to be. Yeah. I'm switching to, uh, to like a music thing. I didn't know that we, we did this live stream, mm-hmm. um, this YouTube live stream. And I didn't know that you were also had so much producer experience. Oh yeah. I had no idea. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, before I made a song, I was producing. Yeah. Yeah. What was it? What was it that like? That's for sure. Obviously, a reason that your music's so good because like you have that. Yeah, 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 yeah. What do you think that taught you that translates over so much? My mom. My mom. She listens to a lot of um. All right. So like when I was a kid, she used to listen to this band named Chicago a lot, Mm -hmm. which was like, you Chicago? Fire, bro. Steven loves it. Fire, bro. (laughs) Fire, bro. (laughs) But. Like, my mom just introduced me to a lot of different sounds before I, as a kid, established what I liked and didn't like as music. Right. So I just listen to everything. Right. And then I get to choose. So now I can listen to, like, ACDC to fucking 
Freddie Mercury to fuck from Queens to nice. Kevin from Tame Impala to fucking Mac DeMarco to fucking the girl and like, I could listen to everything crossing genres, everything. Yeah, yeah. And like I had to though. learn that. I, I was only that? I was only listening to to rap for like the longest time. Mm-mm. Yeah. See, I I came in the game not like I liked the rap and shit like that, but the only rap I listened to was like the West Coast gangster rap, like mm-hmm. Tupac's the. Ice Cubes, the Easy E's, like them, like oh no, I'm lying. And and G Unit, that was it though. Out okay, the, okay. The East Coast, G yeah. Unit. Oh my God. Right, right. Well, shot, saw me fifty. What the <laughs> hell? But nah. yeah. yeah, yeah. So I, I, I just had all these, um, I had all these this this great music and bands around me at a very early age to help me decide musically where I want to go, which direction I'd want to go, and stuff like that. That's that's. To, to anyone out there that's watching this that wants to make music, I highly suggest you get your playlist on lock. Mm. Like, get your music playlist on lock of all the songs you listen to and stuff like that. When you play it in the car, you should know all the lyrics word by... That's another thing. I know every single song that's in my phone or whatever yeah. from any artist. I don't care if it's in Skilly Bang, Anardo Wick, uh, right, right. The 16 Chopper song. Like, bro, anything, I know the lyrics. You know every word. I know the lyrics. Yeah, head to toe. Do you learn them fast? Like, can you memorize lyrics like yes. after a few listens? Yes. Yeah, 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 yes. yeah. What is yes. that from? What? How? I don't know. Yeah, I, I yeah, love yeah, music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since yeah. a, a kid, though. Yeah. Since a kid. Right, 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 right. To the point where, like, 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 I remember songs so much that, like, but, like, I remember as a kid, my mom hearing me sing the songs and be like, 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 let's say, like, the word was Nirvana, mm-hmm. and when I heard it, I thought it was another word. Or yeah, yeah, like yeah, that. yeah, yeah. But, but. My mom would hear me repeat it and be like, what did you just say? Right, right, right. She'll you, correct you. You know the lyrics so much, you don't even know what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I wow. wanted to know the lyrics so bad. Yeah, yeah, by heart. I, I knew everything. Whatever was telling you to exactly what you needed to do, the music you needed to make, yeah. the studio, all those revelations. Friends that you, you need to cut out. Always there. It was always. always there. Always. It's up to you to listen. Yeah. Then it's up to you to take it serious. But people cover it up like with... I don't know. I don't know what it is. Like, like trauma. Like, I think I know what it is. What do you think well, it is? N- not, not fully, but I think I might know. I, I feel like they've never put it into motion to yes. have it work out. To even so have that ball know. rolling. Yeah, right. facts. Hence, hence, like what I was saying to my homie T. Like, you got certain dudes out there that know your your nobody in your family was a, a millionaire or nobody around you or anything like that is super successful to where you'd feel like I got this bag too right to where you probably now in the streets ready to shoot kill gang bang and all types of shit because you think that's just that's everybody just else is doing it you just following suit right whole time there's and, billionaires and, out there too bro you don't want to follow suit with a billionaire right right you don't want to follow suit with a millionaire and even them who knows they could be like completely moving in like i don't know what, what sometimes it's like it's like completely good sometimes it's like completely yeah easy. There's a whole but i'd rather take i'd rather take those chances and yeah than the crumbs, bro. Yeah, for in the sure. hood doing nothing, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. I rather take them chances, bro. Yeah, because it, then, then it, I just sent my mom thirty thousand dollars the other month, bro. Like, beautiful. I wow. can't keep uh, that is incredible. I can't keep doing. That's amazing. Like, I, but a couple years ago, ain't no way y'all. I thought I'd be able to do, or I'd yeah. be able to build my platform up to where I'd be able to really take care of business. Yeah, and now, which is insane because uh, outside looking in. To us, like you're these savage, like people. People think that people have it all figured out, but it takes their process too. Yeah, no. Yeah. And even though people think they have it figured out, whatever you might have working for you, that might work that year. Mm-hmm. Like it's hard to make that a longevity type thing, and um, and and it's hard. And at the same time, it's not hard if you were to just listen to that your inner conscience, like we're, we're like what we were just saying. I'm telling you, bro, like. And to those that are watching this, if you're not practicing it right now, uh, as far as like listening to your inner conscience, um, that that's fine. You don't have to do it right this second, but please, for like the, this next week or month or whatever, try it. Yeah. Just try it. Try listening to your inner conscience. Try doing some of this sh- like that you know you need to do, and then after you complete it, like you'll feel so good, bro. You'll you feel, feel closer to yourself right. each time, to who you actually are. And then th- who you actually are is so good. That person is so good. Like that conscious, like yep. that pure conscious with nothing else yep. is like always on point. Yep. Yeah. Yep. And then and then that's when you start to really love yourself, bro. Yeah. Or learn what it's like to love. But yeah. It's it, it's hard. Like we like th- I think if anything, like that is an amazing message. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, and that's and that's stuff that like, bro, nobody told me, and nobody yeah. tried to like teach me. I had to figure that out on my own. Like, yeah. And but now that I know that, I feel unstoppable. Like, bro, yeah. these don't have to kill me, Nirvana. Yes, I'm. He, I'm you I'm, went through the the whatever hellscape, and now you're you like broke out the other side. It's over with, bro. And yes. I'm not going back no to way. that way of thinking, bro. I'm yeah. never going back. I don't care if I'm in jail. I'm yeah. never thinking like that, bro. Ever, yeah. ever. I'm ready, bro. Like they won't have to really uh, like to stop this sh- going on. They're gonna have to kill me, bro. Like I'm fired up. I'm f- yeah. fired up. You feel that, Ty? I'm fired up right now, boys. For real. That's what I'm fucking talking. Dead about. Ass serious, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Cause I'm so I'm I just want to be that humble giant. Like look at Drake. Yeah. Drake can go live every day right now if he wanted to and say I'm the. Sh-. Yeah. Fuck all of you. Yeah. <laughs> All of y'all, huh? <laughs> yeah. I run this, but does he? Nah, no. he might throw out like cool bars every other song and sh- that, letting you know he's the sh- and stuff. But that's mm-hmm. that's just music, does he? Is the sh- you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, I love that though. Yeah, humble be, and I feel like that's the reason why he's he's will for always always be number one. Yeah, always. Yeah, like always, like, and I that's that's the, this this is a little off topic, but but that, that it just reminded me Juice World, bro, like. I remember right when Juice died, Drake's competition was Juice World. Wow. And yeah, that's true. That's Juice crazy. World was the same humble person too. Like Juice World was me and Juice World started coming around and making songs with each other and started hanging out at a time where nobody liked D Savage. So that's why I really don't play with Juice like right. online with with like like any like Juice World slander or like anything like that. Right, right. That was super random. I just had to throw that in. It there. was Sorry. real. No, no, no. No, that's, no, that's, that's real. Like, yeah, that's I love real. like no, that's I have him tattooed here. Yeah. Here. Like I don't I don't play I don't play about that. It's easy. Everyone like comes around and flocks when like your mental's doing good and your career's doing good and yeah. all that. It's the yeah. people that are there yeah. otherwise. And now that I'm now that I'm at a space where it's like I want to show them like look bro. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they all gone type shit. So that's that that type of sucks right but it's like if heaven's real they probably looking down seeing this you know? surely for so. sure from uh just to like to to like you know appease the fans and and give them the information they want like what can we in the immediate distant future can we uh, res- aspe- expect from d savage and how long into the future do you think about about things um question to your question mm-hmm. um um um, how long would it be until like, like, like I drop or stuff like, or like, like content or, or, or do you just mean like, like an overall in an overall sense, like where is your head at with, you're in this like amazing place mentally, yeah. career wise. What do you feel like with even drop schedule or like the type of music you want to make and just overall in your career? Like, okay. how, how far distant do you think okay, about I got it? it? Yeah. Um, I've thought about everything that I'm, that I'll do tomorrow. Last year. Yeah. And sometimes that's like a curse because you think so hard. Yeah. That it's overwhelming. You, like, and, and I, I think so strategical that it's like, like, okay. Like, this, 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 this isn't a good thing though. Like, so I don't want, I don't want anybody to hear this and be like, does he think that's cool or anything? But like, I can, I can sit back and think about some, shit, right? Mm-hmm. I execute it, and while I'm executing it, I'll be thinking like, if anybody says this or that, you got to do this, or you got to punish them, you got to do this, you got to mm-hmm. do that. Mm-hmm. So now, like, when it's time to execute, shit, and I might see little shit that I don't like, I gotta learn to, okay, don't even look that direction. Keep looking, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Keep mm-hmm. myself centered. No distractions, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah. I don't have room for any distractions no, now, bro. No, can't afford it. Yeah. And it's interesting because when anytime anyone says it's only about them if someone says anything to anyone negative. Yeah. It's only about if I'm like, oh, I, I don't like this and that, and I'm like hating in some way. Yeah. Obviously I think you look cooler than me or right. you this or that, and right. it's reflecting on me and it makes me feel scaled and they're you know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. That's all it is. For sure, for sure. But yeah, it's every like, time. But 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 it takes a smart individual to come up with that. Right, right. Right. Or to know that, not to come up with that. To know I that. think to it takes waiting, outweighting the initial fury, because because like you know, I I like anyone else, and anyone gets like absolutely goddamn furious about things. Right. But it takes like 
okay, let me just outweigh it. Let me just wait. It might take an hour. It might take two hours, a day, two days. If I can outweigh that, then I'll see things clearly. Yeah, and, and the thing that was so bad with me but was like me telling myself, like, just wait, wait. It would be like, you're a, am I, mm-hmm, like, what, mm-hmm, what am I waiting for? Right, right, I'm waiting right, for shit. Right, right. Like, right. Nah, I'm going to get you. Right. And but you know you we know you have like you know you have that yeah like you, you you know yeah, yeah yeah but but bro there's a lot of people that don't know me bro that mm-hmm. th- that see me online they think I'm just some light skinned capper mm-hmm, mm-hmm. that like man yeah. Yeah. but it but, can be that it can be the dichotomy of that can't fuck with them but also intelligent thought out thoughtful yeah self has looked with but nobody but this is how I used to feel but nobody would even want to see me or nobody would even want me to could talk to me while I'm there because right. they so stern on this kid. Right, right. That it's like, damn, y'all gonna kill me before y'all even get a chance to see I was a good person. Right, too. right, right. Well, I think now they're gonna see it in a whole new light. And yeah, I appreciate you being so, so fucking transparent. Of course. Amazing. Yeah, Amazing. I love you, Nirvana. Know, there's there's, there's nothing, boy. I don't care about these cameras being here. I would have, I'd be telling you this. We've had these conversations. Come on, that's what they don't know. You know, I love you, bro. But you know what I mean. Like, like this. I feel like I have to be transparent because, like, we're all human. There's mm-hmm. literally not one entity on this earth that isn't a human, uh, separate than like insects and like that. Yeah, obviously. yeah, non-humans. Yeah, everybody human, bro. Yeah. So, so uh, you, I, I was, I, I, I've been surprised how many people would understand my struggle. Yeah. So we're all human. So what do you expect? But. And they're going to continue to. The more that you say it like this, it's just so well articulated. They're going to absolutely feel heard. Yeah, thank you. That's more than thank anything. Thank you for real. That's that's oh, really yeah. all I that's really all I wanted to be be right right now at this yeah. at this specific moment. Yeah, I yeah. just want to be heard, bro. Yeah. Like type I want people to know I'm not an asshole. Yeah. Like type sh- Thank you for giving me the chance to do this too, bro. Yeah, dude. Come on. Of for course. For real. Anytime. For real. They're going to love it. And uh you know, I don't know. Like, comment like if there's if you do want. I'm sure we'll do this again at some point. Like, whatever else. I'm sure this really like, like gave you guys a lot of perspective on the guy, guys of fucking beauty. Um, and like tell us like whatever else like you want to know next time and and stuff for. Yeah. I'm I'm sure he's gonna like read through them. Like, yeah, I'm no, I'm like, definitely gonna go through all the comments. Yeah, like, I'm probably like, gonna respond like, back to y'all. Like, say things that that like point out what you thought like helped you or that you identified with. For real, because that shit like for me means a lot, and I know for him means a lot. It means so, so much. Cool. And yeah. just 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 let you guys know if you guys DM me, like any any little thing that you guys just need to get off your chest with me, I'm probably gonna respond. If if, if I don't respond to everything, I'm sorry, but I'm I'm probably gonna respond. So try me. I mean, how many poppin' are It's so special. It's such a different mindset. Yeah, and I love it. Also, like and subscribe. Let's get to 200k. Please, for fun. come on. Yeah, Let's get man. 200k for for crying out loud. Come on. Thank you, bro. Of course, bro. Really? Thank you for having me, man. Goodbye.